Alright, hi everyone. We are going to press a couple of the plants we just picked out in the courtyard. This is a really simple, fast process. Um, so, we are going to use cardboard, paper, plywood, and um, this process is going to take about maybe about a week to get the plants fully dry. Um, when you put the plant on the piece of paper, you want to make sure to label it where you harvested it and what date it was. Because herbariums are used for keeping a record of what was there. So in a hundred years, hopefully this herbarium collection still exists, you can go back and get a record of what plants were growing out in this area and what part of the year and um, what not. So um, this first specimen we're going to label it, we picked it in Northwest Boston Courtyard. We're going to write that down and the date. Ten, fourteen, twenty. Have cardboard for um, airflow. And this paper is going to help draw the moisture off the plant. Another piece of paper. Another piece of cardboard and set it aside. Another piece of cardboard, piece of drying paper. Um, you want to make sure everything is displayed nice. Um, you want to make sure you have the fronts and the backs of the leaves displayed and the fruit, the twigs. And once the plant's dry, we're going to glue it down to paper to preserve it. This one, this seed ball, we're not going to be able to smash in the press, so I'm just going to leave it hanging off the side. Slide it into the press. Just tighten these down and put it in a well ventilated area. Check on it in a couple days, make sure we don't need to replace the pieces of paper because we do not want the plants to mold. So if the pieces of paper become too wet, we'll have to replace them with dry ones. And I just cut my finger. Uh -oh. Ouch. All right, well, that's that.